Hello everyone. Here is a Cortelco Patriot 2 phone with memory. The model is... Does it even say? Oh, it does. The model is 219-400-VOE-27S. On the back, besides the information, there's, of course, the phone jack, a spot for the wall mount bracket, and uh, this this is a selector switch for the voicemail light, with the voicemail indicator light, and this lets it choose whether it monitors the inner pair of the phone cord or the outer pair. And then these are flash time control dip switches. Here's the ringer. On the side, you've got receiver volume control with three levels. Ringer volume with, again, three levels. And tone pulse, along with a pass-through for the phone line. And here are your ten memory buttons. It does come with a piece of paper, but I've written people's names in there, so I can't show it in the video, unfortunately. But basically it has ten little strips, and each pair of strips is as tall as one of these buttons, since there are five rows of buttons. And there's flash, store, redial, which is the same as pause, and hold with an indicator light. Here's the ringer and voicemail light. And the cool Cortelco logo up there. And then here's the dialing keypad. And there's the uh, wall mount tab here, along with the piece of paper where you'd write this phone's number. This is very easy to get messed up in here, unfortunately. Okay. On the handset, it does say Cortelco. It gets pretty distorted at the highest volume level, but pretty much just on dial tone. I'm not sure why it has that 60 hertz buzz in there. This didn't used to, but, but I just discovered it does that today. Even though I've had this thing for almost almost two years. I'm not sure why it started doing that. And if you want to program a phone number in there, you just press store and enter the phone number. You can actually hear it make a little very quiet beeping noise. should have that number stored. And there you go. Here's redial, which as I said is exactly the same as pause, which pause, pause also does redial. And redial inserts a pause when you're uh, programming a phone number. There's flash. and hold, gives you the red light there. And another thing that I like about this phone is that 
the hold feature actually turns off when you pick up another phone. I guess most do that, but that's still pretty cool, and I didn't actually realize that uh, until I got this phone. So now, I'll uh, let it do ring back, and you can hear how the ringer sounds. Oops. I think that was the wrong switch. Okay. Oh. Whoops, the other phones were on. Okay. That's low. There's high. And really, it does sound like a pretty generic business phone ringer. You can see the light flashing when it did when it rang. And uh, the receiver actually has a very nice weight to it. It's clearly a weighted receiver. And the cord that it comes with is actually a 12-foot cord. And you can see it's a nice, thick cord. And I've, I've stretched this thing out many times, and as you can see, it goes right back to being uh, fully tightened. And in case I didn't show you, speaking of cords, it has a channel for the cord, the phone line cord to come out of. And also on the back has actual rounded rubber feet. The rounded ones are helpful because if the phone or the surface isn't quite level, then the rounded ones allow it to still make a contact on all four footers, or whatever they're called. So uh, that's about it for this phone. I hope this was useful, and thank you for watching.